teams that are playing way better than everyone thought they would be playing. First off, I think the Red Sox are playing way better than people really people thought they were going to be playing because they are second in the AL East, 11 games over 500, and the offense has been carrying them lately this whole season. And their pitching is decent, but their hitting has just been helping them so much. And even though the Mookie Betts, they got rid of him a couple years ago, they've just been picking it up a notch. J.D. Martinez playing really well. Rafael Devers, Xander Bogarts. Even some like people you wouldn't really think were helping, like Alex Verdugo, Christian Vasquez, and Hunter Renfro are really helping this team with their struggles that everyone thought they were going to have. And Nathan Evaldi has been pitching really well. Nick Pavetta pitching way better than people thought. Eduardo Rodriguez, he's not really pitching well, but like lots of the pitchers on the team are pitching way better than everyone thought they were. Garrett Whitlock was literally a guy who came from the Rule 5 draft. The Yankees got rid of him, and now he has... 1.73 1.73 ERA. Crazy stuff. And I just think they're playing way better than they were supposed to be playing this year. Another team is the San Francisco Giants. I think they're just playing really well, really good baseball this year. Last year, they barely missed the playoffs. And this year, I think they might even have a chance of winning the division even though people didn't even think they were going to make the playoffs this year. Buster Posey, all their veteran players that they have, Buster Posey, Evan Longoria, have been really playing well. Brandon Crawford has been playing solidly. And their team is playing way better than they have. Their hitting is decent, but their pitching is just way better this year from people you would not be expecting to be pitching this well, like Kevin Gossman. He's always been like a solid 3, 4 ERA guy, but pitching 1.40 ERA, crazy stuff. And Anthony DiSclefani, a 3.51. I think he had a better ERA before, but still pretty solid for him. And their whole team just has solid ERAs, no, no crazy like 6 ERA, except for the bullpen. And I think uh, they have a chance of winning this division, even though the Dodgers, and the Padres, two really good teams are in their division. And the third and final team is the Chicago Cubs. I think they are, we're not supposed to do well this year because they got rid of Hugh Darvish and Victor Caratini, two really great people from the team. Hugh Darvish, just a really solid pitcher. I just think, I heard some rumors that they might get rid of Chris Bryant, they might if they don't if they're not close to the playoffs this year, but he's having a crazy year this year. Back to his old ways. Three sixteen batting average and a three ninety seven on base percentage. Crazy stuff. Javier Baez, even though the average is kinda low, two forty five. I mean all averages are pretty low this year. He's just been hitting home runs and RBIs, two things you need for a great team. And the whole team is just, the offense is playing pretty well, but their pitching is also playing really well. It's just a whole group effort. And Jock Peterson was a pretty good grab this off season, And it's just a nice addition for them with a good, I mean, he's not, he doesn't have the greatest average, but decent on base percentage. It's just crazy how well they're doing this year. No one, Liam Hendrick, Kyle Hendricks, sorry about that, is pitching not as good as people expected. He was always like a three ERA guy and it's their bull. I mean, their ERA is not that good for all these pitchers. Zach Davies, he's a solid pitcher. They have all these solid pitchers on the team, but the ERA is not that good. So I don't know how long they can sustain the success with all these pitchers with super high ERAs. But Craig Kimbrell, he's been pitching really well with a 0.78 ERA this year. Crazy stuff. Back to his old ways so far. 
because his last couple seasons were not so good. Comment down below if you think I missed a team. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one.